we think that we always need to be busy so that we will feel productive and if we slow down it will start to fall apart and everything that we have earned till now will start collapsing but this is not true sometimes you just need a break from all the chaos that goes around you sometimes you just need to take a step back uh, you know take a deep breath and uh, just embrace how much far you have came till now and this is where time management comes into the conversation Today we are going to talk about time management and how it can help you uh, to you know gain that extra hour in the day uh, to relax yourself to make yourself a bit more happy each day. So yeah, let's just start with today's video. So let's talk about the definition of time management. Here I am not going to tell you the basic Wikipedia definition because we all do need that. I will just explain you in my words what basically time management is all about. Time management is basically you know uh, defining time for your particular task and at the end of the day organizing your life so that you can. You know, get the maximum out at the end of the day. So this is what time management is all about. You know, managing your time and you know getting that extra one hour or extra time uh, from those you know crunch of uh, the tasks that you need to do for yourself so you can relax at the end of the day. So this is where time management helps, and this is this my definition. I use time management to you know uh, give myself satisfaction that yes, I have completed my task in my time and now I can relax at the end of the day. So yeah, this is what time management. Basically. The point that tops my list today is you know making the to-do list for the day. You know I have been talking about this for a long period of time, and you guys are also familiar with how we are going to make to-do list and weekly plans. So this is the topmost and the most important thing you need to do if you want to you know start a time management in your life. So you know what you need to do is one night before you need to you know make a to-do list of all the tasks that you need to complete the next day. This is how it works. And if you are making a weekly plan, you need to uh, plan your entire week on the Sunday evenings. And this uh, is something that is going to help you prioritize your task, manage your task, manage your time, and you know exactly knowing what you need to do. To do list helps you to know what task you need to complete in a day. Every day in the morning, you need to just get up, see the to do list that you made one night earlier, and now you have a list of tasks that you need to do today. Rather than thinking of okay, you need to do this, you need to do that, you have a physical sheet. In which you have all the tasks that you need to complete. So this is very important if you want to learn time management. So we do need to shift our focus from you know tasks to results. And now it's time to see what results you are getting into that particular time rather than how many tasks you are completing in that time. So this is a uh, very important because we have a tendency that we you know uh, think that oh my god I have done ten tasks today I have been much more productive. But you know apart from that just see the result. Are the results enough? for your day or you know this is why you need to analyze your the results that you are getting rather than how many tasks you have done in a day what that means is being busy is not being effective so what you need to be in a day is you need to be effective rather than being busy so yeah uh, the next point that we have here is we own our time basically what this means is that uh, we are always in full control of how we want to spend our time uh, sometimes we just uh, have excuses like shit yaar mujhe to wo karna hi pada or shit yaar uh, that was something that i just had to do this is not how it works we are in full control of how we want to spend our time we are in full control of how we want to organize our day we don't need to you know get an external force uh, or we don't want someone else to pressure us that you need to do this you need to do that we have that perspective uh, of time that uh, you know we don't have control of how we want to spend our time but you know this is totally wrong we ourselves are in full control of how you want to do or if you want to do a particular task now you need to set a time for yourself you have that control on your life that yes this is the xyz time when i'm going to do this xyz work so this is how it works just you know uh, remember or remind yourself always that uh, we are in control of our time we own our time this uh, is the most important if we have uh, this perspective uh, perspective now that yes uh, my the time is in my control that everything just works perfectly just works absolutely fine this is one of the most important points in today's video so always have a highlight for the day something that you need to prioritize from the entire day for example today i have a sports something that i need to attend so that is going to be my top most priority or that is going to be a highlight for the day so this is how it works always prioritize something uh, that is important for the day and that is going to be the highlight for the day and you know every other other task that revolves around that you know highlight for the day so this uh, always helps because sometimes na uh, you have that in your head that yes today the main task that i need to complete is xyz 
so you know you work all your force towards that task and that task is eventually completed till the end of the day and you know if you also complete the highlight of the day now you feel satisfied at the end of the day but if you have your know, 10 different tasks and you you know uh, don't know when to complete those so you just are not at all satisfied at the end of the day but now you have a highlight even if you complete the highlight for the day now you would be much more satisfied when you go to sleep at night so this is how it works so always have a highlight for the day for example today as i said i want to go to a sports event so that's the highlight for the day for me today so yeah that is how this works Uh, now talking about the next uh, point here uh, we need to batch things together for example now i'm going out for a program so here i'm going to do all the tasks that require me to go outside from my house for example buying groceries or buying something or you know meeting a friend or any task that i have that requires me to go outside i'm going to do all those tasks together so this is what batching tasks together means you need to batch all those tasks that are related to each other together and do it just in one go rather than going back and forth to do a task this is much more efficient yeah now let's conclude today's video so basically you need to know that you own your own time and apart from that uh, being effective is not always being busy so you need to definitely organize everything make the to do list make the daily plans weekly plans prioritize your things that you need to complete in a day highlight uh, have a highlight of the day and apart from that know that you are a human being and at the end of the day you definitely need rest for yourself uh, then only you can uh, you know work effectively the next day so prioritize your task according to that and make a very very nice uh, you know a to do list for the day and follow those to do list make a schedule that you need to follow and if you can stick to your schedule uh, definitely it is going to help you manage your time and at the end of the day time management is all that we need to make your life a bit more organized a bit more synchronized and at the end of the day you will feel satisfied if you follow and stick to the schedule that you create for yourself so as i this i think this will be it for this video i hope you like the video and if you do don't forget to hit that like button subscribe to my channel and also comment down below what you think about the video as you will in the next one and then stay home stay safe bye i love you guys so much thank you so much for all the support as you guys in the next one and then bye